You got a staircase for parasaurs. What have you done to my life? I'm a 26 year old man, goddammit. Can we play Minecraft right now? No! Ah! Welcome to the Thunderdome! <laughs> Grade A strategy right here, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Come on in, Pooper Skittles. Oh, down here. Ah! Backfire! Backfire, I'm stuck! What the hell? Hey guys, what's going on? Riot here playing Pixar here finally on the uh, the Alpha Tribe server with my buddies DMAC and everybody freaking else. Now, I'm extremely heartbroken. I just recorded for 20 minutes before realizing the OBS had stopped recording. I might cry right now, but for the sake of how freaking fun I'm or how much fun I'm having and for the epicness of this survival series, I'm going to power through and just catch you guys up on what's going on. So I just started out level one, literally, I love, love, literally just got to level 16 as I'm speaking. This is my starter out stuff, my armor and pick and everything. DMAC was awesome enough to give me. Their bases are all in the remote vicinity. I'm gonna go find them right now so you guys know what's going on with the awesomeness. Looks like the camera's not even focusing on me anymore, which is cool. Um, yes, you guys should definitely leave a like on the video if you guys want more multiplayer adventures on Pixar and stuff, because that's definitely an option. And this right here was the most intense moment of my life. I um, made this little hole and I brought this coyote into it and now it hates my guts. And it's been a whole adventure. This is a temporary little camp I just set up so I can make berries in an attempt to get this, I mean make arrows. This is a mean creature! And welcome to my survival series. I'm still trying not to cry, but honestly with the help and support of you guys I think I can power through. Alright, so basically where I left off was I really want this coyote. He's awesome, I got him in a hole. He's a whole coyote, it sounds great. I don't, I'm not nearly high enough level to tame a trike yet, so I was thinking about trying to tame this guy here. Because it's taking me forever, forever, to gather all the narco berries needed. And yes, we have numerous crazy adventures laid out throughout today's episode that I still have to get to. So if you guys want to see more Pixar, or yeah, generally more multiplayer adventures with the buddies, I think there's like Mr. Miola, Vintage Beef, King Daddy D-Mac, a generic B, Pungents, and like 20 other YouTubers on the server. So yeah, if you guys want to see more on here, make sure to leave a like and let me try and find out where the hell I was all that time ago. So sad. So sad. But you, buddy, you big-headed goofball, I feel like you could really help us in the terms of um, collecting berries because look at my hotbar. I've got 10. I've got 10 berries. That is just not a good amount of berries as far as I'm considered. I've also spilled. There's someone's house right there. I'll go see who that is too. Just been kind of collecting my soils and rocks. My stuff right here, you know what I'm saying? There's my little collection. I've got some copper, some coal. Anyways, we're facing world domination. And I am so horrified right now that it's just going to stop recording magically. That I don't even want to, want to, want to, want to, want to fart or nothing. Make me a bow, stupid. Hang on, where are you? Okay, we need more leather. Stop putting all your stuff in your, in your little toolbox, Johnny. Big thanks to DMAC for the weapons and everything. It's literally made the beginning of the game a bajillion times easier just because we, we could go right to killing Dylos, which are usually a huge pain in the buttocks. What do we need with you, buddy? Just more wood. Oh, hell yeah. All right, because I kind of need to, um, I kind of need to kill that wolf over there if I'm going to try and tame that parasaur. It's just the world we're living in. He's right in the, there's two of them over there. I haven't even tamed a parasaur in this yet. They look really cool. Adorable. They look freaking adorable. But, um, yeah, I think that'd be awesome. I'm just hoping they kind of also give you the ability to... No! 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 Oh, Lord! Well, I just crafted a buttload of spears. Not running out of those anytime soon. Jesus Christ! Why do they look so much like arrows? Who's the, who's the limp noodle? Who's got the big pair of diapers around here? Luckily, as you can see with this pick, this pick is freaking insane at gathering and not to mention, this be a YouTuber server where everyone generally turns their stuff up pretty high because, um, well, we got videos to record and stuff, man. You know how long these things take to edit? This face doesn't look this pretty until I add in all the filters, all right? I'm actually an 87 year old black woman. I feel like it almost might go kind of racist because I mentioned the color, but to be honest, I just saw Deadpool and I was just thinking of his roommate. Y'all shouldn't be so sensitive. But I brought it up and now we're in a weird place. Ooh, no, it's weird. Let's go back to Deadpool. All right, so that wolves over there. Parasaur is only level two. You should be prime time for berry time, buddy. 
Or you is the... Hang on, actually, I'm gonna show you guys the wickedness of my trap. The beauty of my trap house. There's a third one around here somewhere too. That's what I'm extra scared about. Welcome to the Thunderdome! <laughs> Grade A strategy right here, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Come on in, Pooper Skittles. Oh, down here. Ah! Backfire! Backfire, I'm stuck! What the hell? Stop it! Dude, dude, oh my god. Ah! Backfire! What the shiz, dude? Get in there, God! Holy hell, and now welcome to the Thunderdome. That was a little ridiculous right there. No, 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 good lord. Good lord, all right, back in your cage. This is the intensity we go through right here to tame this. But they're saved! That's all that matters, man. So many burnt down trees all over the area. So much charcoal provided. No! Anakin, you're going somewhere I can't follow! Or whatever the hell Padme says. Padme was she got such chick such a chick said dumb. Chick chick is dumb just dumb. I'm sorry. But you should have known Anakin was going towards the dark side in the second movie when he comes back talking about how he just slaughtered a bunch of kids and women and everything. And then in the third movie, what? Anakin slaughtered younglings? He hasn't done that in like years. That's so unlike him. Like Padme, come on. I I firmly believe she's responsible for Darth Vader solely, and everyone else is kinda just like side characters. No, God damn. And, then, and, then, and then she gets so sad she died. No, no, just we're done talking about her. Come here, you big shiny butt muffin. What do you mean I'm starving? Oh, well, that's good. You guys missed the beginning of the video where I kind of just yelled at my character for eating too much the whole time. Although I feel like it's kind of relatable because that's something we could all relate to right there. I feel like I'm constantly yelling at my body for being hungry all the time. Stupid idiot body. I'd be able to get so much more done in life. I wasn't always worried about this. I'm about to become the Parasaur girl on the server. You realize that? I'm gonna be Michonne with these two. I'm gonna have to cut their mouths off so they don't try anything fancy. But on the upside, wait, how are we getting these guys out of here? Actually, can I even craft a saddle for them yet? Yay! And a balloon parachute just sounds downright sexy. What quicker way is there to a girl's underwear than a balloon parachute? Riddle me that one, Batman. Where do you have two saddles for him? I love this game. It's like all the fun of Ark. Without Gigas eating all the fun of Ark. No, it's like all the fun of Ark without freaking seagulls stealing from you. I will never get over that. Who is the developer that's like, you know what this game needs? Some seagulls that just steal items right out of their pocket. Just, just freaking seagulls, bro. I will, I will never get on the same page as that. I don't understand. I live in LA. We have seagulls that steal food out of our hands. It sucks. Yeah, I'm an animal lover, but I will punch a seagull in the face. I've seen a seagull eat a pigeon. I see him just eat a pigeon and not even chew him. And you want them in our world? Shame on you, sir. Okay, yes, we're about to have both of these. It was horrifying. It wasn't in person, it was on video, but I've been, I've had, in San Pedro, my, a whole part of LA I grew up in. Anytime you're out at a restaurant outside, hold a chip in the face, just hold a chip like this. It's the craziest thing you'll ever see. Dive bombing, man. I think if I rant about Seagulls for at least 30 more seconds will have these tame. Anyways, those little racist bricks. Never mind, looks like we're already good. My animal museum has been updated. Oh, what? Yeah, all right, we got us a fam bam. All right, peeps, welcome to the club. Welcome to the best friends club, where we kill people for best friends. I swear to God, if this stops recording halfway through, if you make me, you know, what kind of memory, we can't miss out any more members with each other. It's just savagery. I know I have too many spears, all right? I'm sorry. Just call me Britney Spears. For <laughs> Britney Spears. All right. Can you support me? Are you a man who supports his woman in all of her triumphant attempts at life? I see. You sexist bastard. All right. We're going to have to try and get these guys out of here the old-fashioned way. Oh! Okay. Let's just all agree not to make any damn noises, shall we? Noises are what carnivores make, sir. Making a staircase for parasaurs. What have you done to my life? I'm a 26-year-old man, goddammit. Can't be playing Minecraft right now. No! Ah! Love of Christ! 
Oh my god, Minecraft rules! Minecraft rules, we're all gonna die! Oh my god, oh lord! How are we getting out of here? How the hell are we getting, okay, we gotta, we, however we're getting out of here, it's gotta be fast. Um, um, we're gonna flood and die right now is what's gonna happen. I think we're on to something. I think we're on to something. Oh, snap. I actually love these guys. Make sure to drop name suggestions for our two parasaurs as well. I will do my best to keep them alive. Keep in mind, this isn't even modded. This is like vanilla. There's an entire chance that I might keep these creatures alive the whole time. You don't know my life. You don't know my story. Now, can you beautiful bastards gather berries? Wheat. Hang on. Let's, let's find out right here. They can! I mean, obviously they better, they're herbivores. All right, let's go ahead and park you and let's go get your brother, or sister, I should say. You're the female. What's the other one? What gender are you, madam? What do you identify with? Not really as much what you identify with, but what's rocking between your legs, Parasaur? Because I need to just know about breeding methods and such. We don't have sex change technology, buddy. And even then, I don't think it works that way. I don't think you're still able to breed. Like, it's just off topic. Basically, all I want is baby parasaurs. Hang on. Yeah, I'm on. Get the food. Get the food. You, well, we're getting a lot of narcoberry seeds, at least. That's cool. We'll be able to grow our own fields of berries. I do like how fast these creatures are as well. Giant land speeders. I do notice they don't have the new Arc TLC update. They look kind of blocky, but whatever. I mean, I feel like that joke's pretty hilarious, but I'm not gonna laugh at my own joke. What are you doing, buddy? I like how the normal creatures, like herbivores, have nice, beautiful eyes, and carnivores have glowy green red eyes. You're a female, too. I got me a couple of sisters. Sister, sister! That was very weird and not okay. Alright, so I do want those, I suppose. Alright, so now it's time to take this guy on a berry hunting spree. Come on. I think they're just, they just, they're good at, they're clearly sp oh, 20 narco berries. Wow, that's like, that's like an hour worth of work right there. But, um, they're clearly, like, they're clearly special when it comes to, I don't know, deriving seeds from the creature. Whose base is this? You're bumping! I guess this world has been up for like a week. I am the last one to join. I, I, I got stuff to do, man. She's. I said she's, it's not cussing. Hey, look, we've made it to Mr. Miola's base. Hey, I made it back to where everyone kind of started out. Hell yeah. Because I'm on my creature. This creature's awesome. Dude, this is amazing. We're going to have so many berries ready. We're going to be able to tame any freaking thing. Oh, my God. These episodes are about to get straight up bananas, son. We start next episode out with like a bajillion narco berries, even though I've kind of yet to get any new ones since the previous one. I'm just going to make a giant narco berry farm. Because clearly that's what we gotta be doing. Damn, look, someone made a whole little fortress in here. Someone fortressed up, son. I don't want to peek in there, because what if, like, there's some stuff in there that's not necessarily been on video yet? I will eat the hell out of your berries, though. You better believe me on that one, buddy. <laughs> Ooh, Deli, hang on. There seems to be a bat attacking a zombie down there. That looks like a sketchy situation I'd like to avoid. Just take your poops, buddy. Big poops. Definitely seem to be getting a lot more narco berries off these dead plants than the alive ones. See, alive one? Nothing. Dead one? Nothing. You know what? Everything just sucks. Hang on. Yeah, we got 18 off that. We're actually getting a good amount. I'm going to be able to do some, um, some crafty stuff. I suppose the Fioma might be everyone's initial tame for, um, gathering berries and such. The parasaurs just look so cool. I couldn't help myself. Plus, there were two next to each other. They were clearly sisters. You don't separate sisters at birth. Well, you do if you want to. But I wanted both of them. I wonder if that one's a dude. Breeding these things would be pretty phenomenal. You know, the craziest thing is my eye's been messing up this whole video. And yet, I've, like, I haven't been able to see out of the left eye at all. It's been ridiculous. But I'm still doing pretty good at life. That makes me happy. <laughs> that's, that's my life in a nutshell right there. I don't know how I'm doing it, but I'm doing it well. Holy crap poops. Look at that. Look at that massive amount of narco berries right there. We might be able to tame something very crazy with this amount of stuff right here. I'm actually very excited. I'm very excited about this survival series right now. We have a nice little tootie poops going. 
Can't wait to mess with the T-Rex trap. I mean, we've got that coyote trap down just, just nicely. Wait till we're caged in T-Rexes. Okay, I need to start finding my way back to my base. Not really so much my base, because it's not a base, just that little area where we're temporarily setting up at. I feel like I don't want to make my base until like episode 10 or something, because I kind of want to get stronger to, um... What the hell is going on here? It just vanished. I kind of want to get strong enough to at least go slightly inland a little bit, not just, um... Not just the initial starter spot area, because it's not the manliest area, you know what I'm saying? There's manlier areas, is all I'm saying. Alright, one thing I wanted to do actually is, um, let's go ahead and craft. Craft a bunch of those. Yeah, craft. What are you doing? Craft as many of those as you can, and, uh, craft a derp a derp. Where's my. You! I still see something really quick. I want to see if we're able to tame this guy. Let me just go ahead and do that. I know last time I killed a copy last time I tried this. But it's worth a shot. Where did the compy go? Oh, there he is. There's one. Alright, watch out for, um... Watch out for the wolf. And I don't think you want to charge it all the way. Just like a baby little... Just a little... Meep! Okay, so they pretty much just vaporize no matter what. What do you need? Slingshot? Is the slingshot the recommended method of... It's gotta be. It's just gotta be. Just need a little more wood. Cause I would love a copy. Like I just kind of want to have one of everything in here. They're they're adorable. They're compatible. Pretty sure it's why they're called copies. So I um. Plus yeah, I just generally want to have a couple of everything. All right. Well, I guess we gotta find more copies. Cause you killed the last one, Parasaur. Parasaur who shall remain unnamed until it gets a name. All right. So where would be a nice place to make it? Just a little temporary. I mean, every base is temporary, because I'd like to always keep moving, and then, you know, you just go back to, um... I guess, because this is pretty much... Then you go back to each base, like, then you just have multiple bases everywhere. But, I mean, um... This place is next to all these portals, and the portals all take you to different areas. So, I feel like it's pretty much not the worst situation. Like, it's kind of dope. Alright, well, if I'm going to stay here, at least temporary, the place has got to be... At least a little more. But I, I, how do you people say beautiful? I think it's just got at least at least not like this jagged cliff behind us. It's savagery. I want that oceanfront property, but I want the oceanfront property to start kind of back here and then continue into. Where shall it start and where shall it continue? I like how he has it's just like riverside, riverside, but um. It would have to be down there more. I suppose just more down the coast and everything, right? That makes sense. We can't just settle here. We settled way too quickly, I suppose. And that's not okay. Did I just over-encumber ourselves? Can I reach you? Yes! Oh, I can reach it! Oh my god, thank you! You shall be my caravan, donkey. Is that okay, donkey? It's a rhetorical question, donkey. All right, and then I'll just bring the rest of this stuff with me. Can I really not? Oh, no, I got to destroy it. What about you? Can I pick you up? That is unfortunate. We cannot die until, um... We cannot die until... Oh, cool, I could just... Oh, wow, that's awesome. Yeah, we cannot die until I place that bed down. That's just the way it's got to be. There's... <laughs> we will lose everything. Yeah, I'm stingy. I'm taking all of it. What of it, man? All right. Come on, buddies. Let's bring my sisters, my sister gals on over. Come on, woman. Don't you go falling off. All right. I just kind of, we'll come back for you. We'll come back for you caged guys, but we got to make sure we have a sexy spot where we can. Ah! Jesus. Wow. Death is always just like a slight step away. That is absolutely bananas. Hey, look, it's German guys base. That's perfect. I feel like we should be near German's base anyways. He's he's good people. All right, so come on. We're making our little aquatic motion. Aquatic navigation. All right, little pooper strudel. Wait, no, 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 no. Passive, 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 passive. Yes, he's asleep. We've done it. Yeah. Dude, yeah, we got a little copy. Level 54, too. I like them. They look like little scary buggers, don't they? Wait, what do you eat? Why aren't you eating meat? 
Are you not carnivorous? I saw Jurassic Park. They eat little girls. Does anybody have any little girls? Why is, can't, why is my eyes so blurry? I can't see it in my left eye. What, do you want to eat, you little fart nuggets? Rotten flesh? That wouldn't make much sense. There we go. I'm not sure what in his inventory is working, but he loves it. What in your inventory was working, buddy? I just kind of put everything in here. See, I wasn't really messing around. Maybe it just took a while to get him? I don't know. But now we've got a little compy on our head. And I call that perfect. All right, buddies. Let's let's navigate on on out of here. Watch out for this guy. I do love this area down here. I'm definitely choosing this area down here. It is it's awesome. It's just flat Greenland. I'm all about that flat Greenland. I like this area right here. It opens up to the ocean, the vast beautiful ocean, which is cool to have access to because there's vast beautiful sea creatures, but it's wherever the hell that little portal takes you. I think this area is just about as nice as I want it, in fact. Oh, thank God. Just like literally right here. Because it's right at the end. It's got a little like cove area. It's got a bunch of grass for our creatures. I love it. Oh, whoops. I'm like digging up the land right there. That's the land we're going to need, silly. If anything, flatten this land out. So, and then I assume it's like Minecraft, right? Like dirt, I mean, grass grows on dirt. If it's attached to other grass, is that what's going on here? I hope... I hope we inherited some of the Minecraft rule. I suppose we'll just witness it right now. We'll learn from first-hand experience, because I do love that in Minecraft, how it just, when grass touches dirt, the dirt starts growing grass. Those dudes sure got a good glimpse of what real life stuff's like. All right, I definitely need a lot more blocks to do what I'm trying to do. But I think initially it would be fun if it was just like a little boathouse. Not a boathouse, but just a water house. Just something that's above the water level, the kind of just pillars going into it, not exactly just, you know what I mean, like downright fancy classness. I feel, oh, now you're doing it again, Johnny. You're poking holes right in your base, but not what you want to be doing here. And then it says, watching you. I kind of fell a little farther than I planned on falling right there, and now I'm a little sketched out for survival. But, yeah, this is just a lot of dirt goes into this stuff. I definitely gonna want to get and my camera turned off like a while ago I forgot how long I've been putting down resources. What's going on people? So um Yeah, a lot of work going into that might have to just kind of do it slightly off camera Unless I want to just build for an hour mid recording which doesn't sound like the most exhilarating thing If I'm being honest with you See this way is better too because now if anyone on the server ever decides to be a funny guy and troll me by tilting the water into my base, it won't happen because I'm above water level. It's not even how the world works. Yeah! Look at that. It's called genius right there. That's called preemptive striking your trolling friends before they get all funny with it. Alright, so I'm probably just going to expand it out just this far, to be honest, and then put some walls up. And then later on, keep... I kind of just want to get a whole mega thing going here. It sounds freaking awesome. I keep trying to crouch so I don't fall off, but apparently that's only in Minecraft as well. So, yes. Watch out for that. Okay, I'm kind of happy with just this. Just this, honestly, for starting out, isn't the worst thing in the world. I kind of always have more of a focus on my creatures than anything else. How do we make these walls? I haven't even experimented with these. Wakaka! I haven't even experimented with these things yet. Alright, wood wall. Stone, or you're actually not that difficult. Okay, see, I feel like stone wall definitely makes the most sense. It's easy to get, and it's the most fortified. Who's calling me? Wait, what was I doing? Some butthole called me and now I'm confused. Okay, hang on. Thanks for your manager, it's coming back. Wait, that's not even, what even are those? The stone walls, the push, okay. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see what's going on. Okay, all right. So you make, okay. Okay, all right, well obviously I have to make a gate. Gates are the most important thing around me. I can't wait to get back on here and actually perfect this, this little, this little poopy dupe that I've just crafted is like the most basic thing I've ever constructed. But, um, it will be epic by the end, trust me. If you were inside my head right now getting visuals of the brain juice that I'm stirring, you'd be probably disgusted, because brain juice sounds absolutely disgusting. But, um, wow, I'm so used to Fortnite. I'm like, if I just hit each tree a little bit, I'll get some resources from all of them. But that's not, that's not the game I'm playing, Johnny. What was the other one I needed? Thatch? Look at all these epic houses. You guys may be able to beat me on your epicness, but I will beat you on creativity. My house will have a stripper pole for T-Rexes. Yeah! How's that for creative? Gonna have the most T-Rex body shaming business on the island, baby. 
That's right. We don't even hire pregnant T-Rexes. Or we only hire pregnant T-Rexes. Ooh, what's worse, dude? What was I doing? Gate? All right. Oh, yeah, I have a copy on me. I forgot about that little dude on my face. Did you see him and you wanted to come hang out with us compies doing compy stuff? Watch out, buddy. You're going to get accidentally hit. I'm just trying to gather stuff for a, for walls. You don't get smacked. It's going to happen. Did you get it? Oh, I told you it would happen. I told you about this. I'm sorry. I snapped a little bit. Now, I guess it's ridiculous, right? If I was to come back, I wanted a creature that specifically could grab, a, grab stone at a much more increased rate. It'd be ridiculous. That is ridiculous. I've got to go get me a, a ridiculous. What the hell is going on here? What? What's happening to the top of these rocks? Is this witchcraft I'm seeing? Oh, it's raining. Wow, that's beautiful. Whoa, wow, that right there. You know how long it took the aisle to get up to this level right here? That's, <laughs> I don't mean to throw stones or anything, but pa -cha! I feel like this is all I'm necessarily gonna need for right now. I just kind of wanted to, um, you know, get it going, get it started, get it. Hey, I need at least 60. My OCD needs 60. There we go. Oh, I thought we almost got 61. That would have sucked. Craft me stone walls, you lackey. All right, where's my gates? Wow, we don't need a gate and a gate door in this? That's that's revolutionary right there. Just one gate? What? Yes, yeah, some towards weight. Dude, these parasaurs are so freaking adorable. Hey, on. Rotate. There we go. I suppose right now I'll just have it like... A little out more but eventually I'm gonna break it down and expand and just have it go all around all sorts of pretty that's the game plan what do you mean you can't play stone wall here oh does it have to be on does it have to be on a structure all right it was a long-awaited wait wow this feels like such a little shanty place right now it's gonna get crazy though trust me okay it's gonna get bananas it's 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 not bananas right now, but to give it some time to develop proper bananas, and you're looking at some seriously bananas stuff right here. Can you stop? Can you stop with the giant? Stop with this. What is this? This is the same downside in every time an arc is giant feet messing everything up for everybody. Oh my God! What is this? This is an issue. It's the same damn issue every time. Large-footed bastards think they can go wherever they want. You don't see how this is an issue? They are. He's clearly hoist. He's, he's pooping on our plants, dude. The dude is pooping on our plant. Now what are you doing? Oh my god. This is absolutely... I mean, thank god he's peaceful, so we don't really have to worry about him getting in. It's just more that, like, he's gonna ruin everything if he does get in. Is what it would appear to be. All right, now in an attempt to just make it higher so so creatures can't just come in here and step on all my stuff, which is crazy. I mean, it makes sense because they're giant dinosaurs, you know, I think. There's really, it's going to be so hard to keep that guy out of here, though. I don't even know how tall the wall needs to be. Probably, probably four or five, to be honest, which is what it's basically at, but it's, the, it's just this giant daddy long leg monster. I feel like this should be able to stop its progression, though. Hopefully, like this should be the limits of how far it could um Like those some tall walls should be able to just peacefully walk over that everything else is gonna get stopped All right, let's go ahead and get our buddies indoors. Dude, we've got so many items on one of these dudes also. It's perfect This is our family. Can you stop? Can you stop? I guess it's fine. It's, it's fine if you want to follow him, but Just don't be surprised when he dies because everyone dies right here. You're the one with all my resources on you, right? I mean all my or just some of the resources I should say look at this look at this little area we've got this is a nice little spot it's the beginning of the end for the entire world right here now as long as you guys stay peaceful there's no reason for someone to come around here and do stuff hey let me just make sure that they know they know who this is they know it's riots yeah they could just derive that that the other ones riots too the, the power of information gathering Make sure to drop name suggestions for those two, though, because they need names, obviously. They can't just be called Parasaur and Riot's Parasaur their whole lives. That's shameful. And leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you beautiful people next time. Peace! It's time to get in here.